This is the Centric from a new company called ISO. And this thing is a steal for a thermoform paddle. So let's get right into it. Here are the specs. The face is Torre T700 raw carbon fiber. It's a hybrid semi-elongated shape. It's thermoformed unibody with foam injected into the edges. It's a 16 millimeter core. It's 16.3 inches long, 7.5 inches wide. It's got a 5.3 inch handle and a 4.125 circumference grip. And the stock weight is listed as 8.3 ounces. And this thing only costs $90 after using promo code Matthew K for a $10 discount. So if you clicked on this video, you probably know you're on the hunt for a thermoform paddle. And you really can't go wrong with this thing. It's got all the tech. It's unibody, thermoform, it's got foam in the edges, and it's at a ridiculously low price. And to me, I have to compare the Centric to the Vatic Pro Flash because they share a lot of similarities. They share really similar construction processes but the biggest similarity is this shape. This hybrid shape is not seen in a lot of thermoform paddles. And that's what really, this hybrid shape gives you that reach, but it also gives you that speed at the kitchen. And that's something that is super desirable and not a lot of thermoform paddles are in this shape. And as for the biggest difference, the Centric comes in at a heavier stock weight. It sort of reminds me how 11624's YSF, which is an elongated thermoform paddle that's super similar to the Vatic Pro V7, comes at a heavier weight as well. And both of those paddles, the Centric and the YSF, just bring more power to the table, just I think more than anything because of how much heavier they are. And for me, that extra power made the Centric a little harder to control compared to the Vac Pro Flash. I could probably mitigate that by adding some weight to the throat, which I've, which I've done. I haven't really had a chance to play with it like that yet, but that will probably help make the Centric a bit more manageable and easier to control. And to be honest, I don't mind a heavier paddle, especially at the bottom, because I already build my grips up to 4.5 inches, and that's something I'm used to. So I don't think it will be an issue. Ultimately, I think the Centric is a great, great thermoform paddle. I especially had fun playing with it uh, in singles. I didn't need to add any weight for that. I was fine as it was. And I just think it's a great paddle. So is the Centric better than the Vatic Pro Flash? Well, the answer is no, it's not. It's just different. To me, the Centric is really similar, but has a bit more power, but a little less control. So it just depends what you're looking for. And I'm super curious how the Centric compares to 6-0's Double Black Diamond, because I've done a few hits with the Double Black Diamond, and it's definitely got a bit more pop than my Vatic Pro Flash. And so I'm curious how the Centric compares. And so if I do review the Double Black Diamond, I'll try to mention the Centric, so be on the lookout. But to be honest, the real differentiator with the Centric from all the other Thermoform paddles out there right now is the price. For example, a Vatic Pro Flash with promo code Matthew K costs $130, and I think that's a great deal. It's the exact right amount of control and power for me. However, the Centric, after promo code Matthew K, it's $90. I mean, that's crazy, that's unbelievable, and so I really don't think anyone would regret getting this paddle. So if you're looking for a thermoformed hybrid shape paddle, you really can't go wrong. This is, this is a great deal. Okay, that's it. That's my review of the Centric. I'll leave a link in the description. Don't forget to use promo code Matthew K. That will get you a discount. That will help me out as well. Also leave some links and codes for some other cool paddles to check out. All of that helps me, helps the channel. And please like and subscribe. That helps too. But most importantly, I hope you get to pickle soon. Just don't forget, it's about having fun.